back to my channel, Danielle here. And before we get started with today's thrift haul video, I want to thank you guys so much for helping this channel hit 10,000 eggies. So you guys, honestly, YouTube would not exist without its views, without its subscribers, without its eggies. So thank you so much for helping me hit this milestone. And because we hit 10K, I want to give back to you guys. And I'm doing a giveaway per usual, and we are doing 10 winners this time. But because this channel is a thrift-related channel, I want to give away 10 Goodwill gift cards to 10 of you lucky eggies. So just stick to the very end. I'm going to have a few rules just so that you can enter the giveaway, but it's super simple. But with that said, y'all, thank you so much for helping me hit 10K. Honestly, this is so freaking awesome. And I love the little community that we built here on this channel. And so I want to do my best to try to give back as much as possible. So let's get straight into this haul. We got veggies this time. Okay, y'all, let's go thrifting. We are outside of a Goodwill. Let's see what we find today. Guys, look at how cool this jacket is. It's got faux fur, suede construction. But they're really upping their prices because this is 20 bucks now. We'll leave it though, that's too much money. Do you guys believe me if I told y'all that I slept overnight in braids? Look at this volume. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> y'all, this place is killing it with the shoes today. These boots have a lace enclosure. Super awesome. Look at these. Yes. These are pretty fun too. Ooh, love them. How much are these gone for? $12. Mm, that's a little much. So many of these pink ones. Okay. So many of these bow tie ones too. Okay you guys, I've got my haul right here. I think I have around like 11 or 12 pieces. I wanna get started with some shoes because I think these shoes are like the best shoes I've ever thrifted. Maybe some of y'all might think they're ugly, but let me know down in the comments because y'all know I like some ugly stuff. But the first shoe I wanna show off is this cool, sock boot it's in this vibrant pop of color purple so i know sock boots are kind of are they still trendy i feel like they were trendy for a hot minute and then they kind of passed but oh you guys i have talked about how i'm really self-conscious of my legs specifically my calf muscles just because they're really small and my ankles are really small and so i love that these boots just hug my ankle i always go with the pointed toe just to elongate my legs you know i'm a sucker for purple like i would wear this with this top right now, love it. I got these platform sandals, they're Steve Madden, and they have the thong here, it's like a gingham pink print, and it's a light pink. Look at this platform, I absolutely love it. And then the, the footbed is like, what would you call this material? Like just straw, woven straw material. I don't usually wear flip flops, but the platform, mm-hmm, got me right away. Let's move on to some tops. I found so much Victoria's Secret, but I try to get more sizes that fit me. Look at this. Top. Okay, well maybe it's a dress, I'm not too sure. But I'm gonna wear it as a top, like I said. And so it has this front tie closure and then nothing else. So it kinda just has this vent right on the front. It has a lace trim and this print, it's just satiny. It is just so pretty. I do wish it kinda had a bit more color, but can't complain for like a really edgy streetwear type look. I have another OG Victoria's Secret and this here is a pop of color so it's right up my alley and it's this button up sleeveless shirt right here. The print is a bit more of a floral color and then I'm not sure whether the previous owner did this but it is a size small and it looks like it could have been tucked in here at the back for a more fitted look. But again we have this satin construction which I think is super pretty. Easily style this with high waisted jeans, some dock boots, and a belt. Yes. Up next, we have this top here, which, you guys, look at this neckline. It is a boat neck, 
but like this collar is so different and I've never seen anything like that. And then of course we have this pastel pink colored, kind of more on the peachy tone, which I absolutely love. And then if you guys look closer, it kind of has like this zigzag construction, which I think is super cute, but still subtle at the same time. I just think it's overall kind of gives like a retro feminine look. Up next are my favorite colors combined into one sweater. And I know you guys are probably thinking sweaters, why it is so freaking hot right now and in Los Angeles. Y'all, all this week is gonna be like mid 80s and for LA, that's actually really, really hot. But I had to walk away with it because it's just so cute. And usually I'm not a fan of Disney, but the colors I couldn't resist. It is this sweater right here. Kind of gives me Christmas vibes with all of the print that you see here. But it's knit construction. Y'all, look at these really pretty baby colors. And it has cats all around. Right in the center it says, we be in a big old heart. And what Disney movie is this? I think I know this. I'm gonna have to look this up. But I'm telling you, I I grew up with Disney, but I'm really not a fan of it. So let me just look this up. Y'all probably already know off the top of your head. But let's see, Disney movie with cats. Oh, here it is. Here it is. It's called The Aristocrats. The Aristocats. Wait, how do you say this? The Aristocats. 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 Why can't I say this? Okay, it is the movie The Aristocats. Yes, okay, I'll just put that away. But not my cup of tea, but these colors, mm-hmm, absolutely love them. We're moving on to some bottoms now, and first up is this really cute skirt. I can never pass up a mini skirt, love this. It's just a green color, and then it has this like brown stitching all throughout. I could already visualize this with a monochrome look and some boots or even some sneakers. That'd be super cute. Up next are these shorts here, they're super cool really contemporary and modern and something that you'd see like in stores now and what was really cool is that this brand pistola which actually means like gun in spanish i saw brand new with tags and everything in goodwill and they had so many pairs of shorts and they were only 4.99 so i was lucky enough to find one in my size and look at these pockets they're super distressed they're high-waisted and then they have this metal right underneath on the pockets here let me show you Look at how cool it is. So it just peeks through and I thought it was so cute. Oh, a trouser. I could never pass on a trouser. I think these are super cool and they are a petite. Y'all know I'm only 5'3", so if I find petite sizes, I am gonna snag them right away. I know, again, this is another piece that is a little too hot and covers a little too much for summer, but I couldn't pass it up. It's a high waist, it's got front pleats, and it just has this like tapered leg. We are moving into some dresses and these are super cool. Okay, so the first one is this maxi dress right here. It's a sleeveless one. It gives me like vintage vibes. The brand is Catherine Dianos. It looks like, you know, like a older looking brand. So really like that. What I really love about this dress, not only are these like really cool buttons, but is that the back has a lace up adjuster so it could really just cinch your waist and fit your body perfectly as you need so if you get a little bloated after a meal you just loosen those puppies up and you will be good to go oh my gosh y'all i think this is the most i've ever spent on a dress at goodwill and i spent 19.99 without a sale and it is this denim dress i couldn't pass it up i absolutely loved it i didn't get to try it on because of covid but i'm hoping that it fits me usually i stray away from these really straight looking silhouettes because my body is already that shape. I usually have to play more with silhouettes, so fingers crossed it looks good. Otherwise, it's probably gonna be posted on my Depop. But it is this denim dress right here. But again, we have a sleeveless look. It is really heavy duty denim. This brand I didn't know, but I'm assuming maybe Goodwill did their homework because it was $20. But this brand, ooh, it's just kind of busy everywhere. If you guys know that brand, and whether it's a good one, let me know. But it says, Hysteric Glamour by Ultra Pink. I'm not too sure. The best company ever. <laughs> okay, so let me just give you guys a little bit more on this dress. It has really colorful stitching here on the shoulders. We've got some patch pockets. We have this floral embroidery right here, which I think is super cool. A lot of seam detailing, front button closure, and y'all, a really cool part, like the other dress, 
It has an adjuster on the back, and this one seems to be more of a buckle. Kind of gives me like western, the fun and quirky vibes. But you guys, that pretty much does it for the end of this thrift haul video. If you liked any of the pieces, give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you're interested in any of them, they'll probably be posted on my Depop. So I am at Twinell and Depop. If you guys want to keep up with me throughout the week, I also have an Instagram and I am at Eggy Girl. So feel free to give me a follow. I also love getting your guys' DMs, whether it's talking about clothes or tattoos or about pets. I absolutely love it, y'all. So reach out to me if you want to. But let's get to this giveaway now. Like I said, I'm giving away 10 Goodwill gift cards. And so it's super simple, y'all. All you need to do is subscribe to this channel and join the Eggy family. And then the second thing is to follow my Instagram. I am at Eggy Girl. And then the third thing, what should the third thing be? The third thing, let's make it super simple. Just comment down below whatever you want. It could be about this haul, it could be about your summer, it could be about quarantine, about COVID, anything. Just comment down below. And then I will be choosing the winner in next week's video. Thanks so much for helping me grow this channel. But as always, I post videos once a week. I'll see you guys next one. Bye!